Hey, fancy beauty symbols, welcome back. I know this is like a weird angle. Hold on. Um, I'm having a lazy day today. I had a lazy day yesterday, uh, but really today because it's raining and all that. So I just finished watching a really good movie. It's called um, Black Box. So uh, Felicia Rashad, she plays in it. So it was really good. It was interesting. The turn it took, I was not expecting. So it was really good. So now... Uh, <sighs> Yesterday and today has been, I've uh, been in a pretty good mood, I guess you can say. Um, kind of, I don't know how to say it. trying to use these pillows to prop y'all up but y'all know my car is in the shop and it needs some um... my hair need to go to the shop too <laughs> anyway um my car is in the shop and needs alternator and it needs a battery so, y'all, <laughs> when I tell you I'm really proud of myself because I did not go through the roof when they told me how much it was going to cost just for an alternator and a battery. So everything all together is approximately fifteen hundred dollars. Um, I'm just thankful to God that I have the money to um, to do the repairs. Um, and let me ask y'all this: Are any of you guys enrolled into that? Um, car uh what is it called car shield um with the iced tea he promotes it and all that so y'all let me know if you guys are enrolled in in that because i respect iced tea um and and you know i know he's celebrity and all this other kind of stuff but a part of me feel like I can trust him when, you know, when he's promoting this company, but I just don't know. And I don't want to sign up for this. And then it's a whole scam. You know what I'm saying? Because if my alternator and my starter, I mean, uh, my alternator and the battery, I expect the battery to go at some point in time, but the alternator and big beauty she not even she not even two years old she won't be two years old until may coming okay may 22 is when she'll be two years old um she is past the warranty and then another thing i was gonna i, I was about to get upset about was because when i bought her I asked the man, because y'all know I just had paid off um, the Malibu and um, the transmission went out on her. So that's the reason why I ended up having to buy another vehicle. But um, when I purchased um, Big Beauty, I asked the salesperson, I said, okay, now if I do this gap insurance, because I always bypass it. If I do this gap insurance, will that 
is that like an extended warranty will it cover for the motor and all these other things you know when the when the manufacturer's warranty expires yes 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 it will yes it will so um i talked to i talked to the lady today about my car about the um truck um she said no she said the gap insurance only covers if the car is uh total so the gap insurance just basically is like a blanket to cover if your car is totaled then they'll pay off the vehicle so um but you know i just said things happen for a reason um, you know, first Jamari had to do, um, COVID, um, quarantine. So he's on quarantine until the 27th of this month. Um, and I was, I, that, that was my key to just sit still for these, two weeks now you know granted it probably was gonna end up going out anyway or whatever but the that monday when i went to go pick jamari up from daycare um i said okay i i came in the house i was all set um god told me to just sit my butt down just for these two weeks and just chill out But no, I had to listen to Bay. He said, go, go out there and make your money, babe. You, you know, I got the boys, blah, blah, blah. You know, because I wanted to get um, some Christmas stuff, um, extra Christmas gifts this year. So, this is what I get for not listening to God and listening to man. This is what he apologized. He apologized. He was like, babe, I'm sorry. He was like, I should have just left everything alone instead of, you know, encouraging you to go out here and make your money. I should have just left you alone. And I'm like, it's okay. You know, you, you didn't know. I didn't know. No, you know, I did know because God told me sit down. <laughs> but, um, so I'm finna uh, sit it out. They said she's probably not gonna be ready until um, Tuesday or Wednesday. Now I had her there at the dealership for the last two days, and you know, a part of me I feel like I want to um, call around and see if I could find. See if I could find somebody else that could do it cheaper. If I said if I was still living out there in Murphy, I had a really, really good mechanic, and I know they wouldn't charge me all this money um, to replace the alternator. <sighs> so now I got to go into prayer and figure out and listen find out if I'm supposed to just leave the car, let the dealership fix it, or if I should, you know, call around, see if I can find a cheaper price. I mean, because $1,500, that's a lot to money. <sighs> On the other hand, I'm thankful that I do have the resources um, to be able to pull from to get to get it fixed. You know what I'm saying? Um, I ain't even tell y'all I had two accidents. Um, both of them, of course, thank God, knock on wood, were not my fault. Um, the first one I was hit from behind, and then the other one, um, they backed out on me and hit the side of the of the car and then just scraped alongside of the alongside of the, the um door uh because they had those two by four beams hanging out the truck 
And, uh, yeah, so. I got, you know, the money coming back from that. So that'll replace this money that I'm spending uh, for the car repairs. Um... I'm just looking at it as, you know, God has a blanket over me right now that's telling me to sit down, chill out. Just don't want to worry about no money. I got you. So, um, that is the mindset that I'm in right now. So, that's what I'm going to roll with. That's what I know. Uh, to be good. So I'm just going to sit up here. And. Um, find me another good movie to watch. Because um, I watched before that. Um, before the black box. I watched uh, Coming to America. That was so funny. <laughs> uh, so I watched that. And then. Um, yeah. It's just crazy right now, y'all. It really is. But I ain't really got nothing too much going on. Not at all. Not at all. Um, I, I'm gonna speak to y'all in code right now. But one of them called. One of them called me yesterday, and uh, the other one text so it's just amazing how fast God works sometimes you know what I mean when you leave it alone when you leave it alone sometimes he works faster than you think he gonna work so I'm I'm thankful for that um I talked to uh one of my childhood friends that I grew up with and uh they uh, reaffirmed to me, you know, that I should not feel the way I feel um, because I am and have always been an, an excellent mother. Um, you know, but like I told them, it, it just... I ain't never been a mama before, okay? And... In my opinion, just being a, just being a kid, you know, growing up, you know how I view my parents growing up, you know. And I just always felt like the one that's gonna tell you the truth is the one that you've been parenting. Your kids is one that's gonna tell you the truth, but then. And at the same time, you know, people have said, you know, with kids, you know, they they will say things to hurt you and um, make you feel bad and things like that. And I wish I could tell you guys the, the last, about the last incident, but I don't know if I, if I'll be overstepping because I know once I tell you guys what it is, you will understand my mindset that day um, that I made the video and why I felt like God should have never made me a mother. Um, I don't know. He'll tell me when the right time is. Just like he, just, you know, I, I don't know if that was God speaking through me to, for me to put that video up, but I was so, I was in so much pain. I was in so much, I don't know. I, I my emotions were just, and, and I've been happy. So it just, I don't know if this. I don't know y'all I just don't know I just felt like I needed to share that get it off of me um 
because I, I always felt like I was holding stuff back from you guys, and I don't ever want to do that. Um, because it, it can get in the way of the connection. Like, when you watch somebody on this platform, you know, you want to know that you're watching a genuine person. And 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 I have to say, you know, just, just given credit to myself, I am... I'm one of the most genuine people you're going to ever meet. And I'm not saying that in a cocky way or a, um, you know, like that. I'm not saying it like that. I'm just saying it because so many years I have downplayed me. Um, I have tried to live, um, Uh, unboastful um, persona, uh, unboastful um, attitude, because um, a, and none of it I could do without God. None of it, and so um, right now I think I'm in in the phase of I, because I, I see you know you know when you watch the um the little TV shows and you know the the the, the kids are saying well my mama was a drug addict or my mama ran the streets or my mama did this and my mama did that and 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 I never did that, you know? Um, so I I had to go tend to the boys real quick. Um, um So yeah, you know, it just <laughs> Um, I just, um, you know, my, my, one of my, my sisters, um, always tell me, uh, stop letting them guilt trip you. I, I got to be a habit of that. I, I do let them do that to me because, um, you know, I, 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 you, I worked all those jobs and I wasn't home and, you know, so I feel, I feel guilty about that. You know, single parent, um, I had to do it by myself. And so I had to sacrifice the time that I actually wanted to pour into my kids over, you know, money so I could pay the bills, you know? Um, <laughs> but you know what's funny? And I never thought I would say this, but the dads, they get all the praise. They get all the praise. And I was right here in the, you know what? I, I'm not going to speak negativity uh, during this time or, 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 or at all. You know what I'm saying? I may come back and do, um, I, I don't know y'all. I'm so confused. Well, it is what it is, and I will talk to y'all later.
because this thing is all over the place. And I'm not finna torture y'all like that. So I'm finna get my crusty hair. It's soft though. And the curls. I'm finna get my crusty hair and my crusty face and my crusty lips. All for this video. And find me another movie to watch. Uh, soon I'm gonna have to um, cook something for us to eat. It's probably gonna be something real simple. Because I don't feel like hovering over no stove. Bay does all the cooking and he had to go out of town. So, um, bye y'all.